This is my Roland VS2480. And I want to give you a close-up of the adapter that goes inside it so that you can stop using a hard disk drive, HDD, and begin using SSD, Solid State Drive. JP103-5. Now, many people are saying that they've tried different IDE to SATA adapters and they haven't been able to get them to work. This is the one that I've used three times now and it works. I had ordered a batch of them and I put them in two of my VS2480s and in one VS2000. Works perfectly. Now, look closely at the pictures so that you get the same one. Because what I realized in one of my other videos is that the picture was not correct. <clears throat> now, that's the master slave setting. And there's that little jumper, you can pull it off. And depending on which prong is sticking out, that's what makes it either the master or slave. So, there you have it. Look closely at the chip pattern so you get the right one. <clears throat> and this is how easily you connect it together. There's the power. There's the data. And I'm going to give you a close-up of the actual SSD that I used. And I just used it, you know, sticky tape to stick it into the hard drive caddy. Now, if you look closely at the fan for the hard drive caddy, I actually cut that wire because that little fan makes a lot of noise. And I don't, I didn't put back on the hard drive caddy cover. I just kind of put it back in the VS the way it is. See, that's where I snipped it. Put it in. Make sure it's nice and snug. And that's it. Have a very good evening. Cheers.